hey guys oh, welcome to my channel netcast on web tech zone in this video tutorial we're going to learn how to set up meeting in outlook or how we can send the uh, how we can send or schedule the team meeting in outlook okay so i'm going to show you in this video tutorial so well, let's start with the video before you start i request if you like this video hit the like button subscribe to my channel and don't forget comments below so let's start with the video so guys i'm going to show you my outlook app so if i was in outlook web then you have to click just a create event and then you have to follow the same follow the same process okay so here come to the outlook app here and this is your home page in mail but in order to set up the meeting or appointment just click on calendar tab this tab may be uh, at you look like this okay so now just select the calendar or you directly go to the new meeting or new appointment so I just create the new meeting here and the new tab will be open so here you, I uh, we need to you know schedule the meeting so this is your mail you can change the name if you have multiple mailbox in your outlook so I have this mail I just schedule the meeting with this email only so first you have to write the you know your title of meeting here you have to click on invite attendance and here you have to choose the meeting peoples who want to join the meeting you have to just add the email id or just click on here or here you can see the all email id from your contacts you can switch the contacts from here and you can write manually also from here like this okay so you can see i have add and this is for optional you can add people who can who can join the as optional or the not mandated for to add join okay so here you can schedule the meetings you have to choose the date i just choose the date and time you should be uh, select from the list so i just select the 19 to 90 30 only a uh, 30 minutes meeting you can change it to uh, one hour so it is one hour meeting now you can change the location and you can make it for all days or you can select the time zone from here okay time zones or just select the time or you can uh, enter the location okay so all setups has been done now okay so here you can see set the reminder for your meeting so for before 15 minutes to uh, one hour here you can make it so by default it is 15 minutes and you can make this as a recurring meeting so it will be sent a multiple time invitation to the peoples okay in recurring meeting you will set the by default invitation uh, send the auto invitation to the peoples so you have to select the day weekly monthly weekly and set the recurring meeting okay and now here is the option you can show the busy okay so for this time you can show you to the your uh, other sh uh, share it uh, guys that you are busy or you are you know work for elsewhere test or free whatever so I make it busy only so this I uh, this icon will show to the people who to whom you have shared your calendar okay that's done and here you can just schedule assistant okay if you have multiple contacts and busy schedule with uh, you have busy schedules person so you can uh, use the schedule assistant and here you can see the all contacts and you can see the all the schedule time of calendar of this person so I think in my case I have free time for all days so I can just select the time here for 9th March and this is for 12 March I have free time okay so if there any busy time it will be show like red or blue so you don't need to select it just select the blank one and you can select blank one and you can see the time has been changed or date has been changed automatically when you select okay and now you can send it and it will be sent to the person who has who you have added to here and it will be sent to these people and you got the reminder before 15 minutes of your meeting okay just send it so guys i hope you like this video please subscribe me thank you for watching